So if someone was able to take a step back and reflect on their life, what they may see is that they have the need to be rescued. And so they may have a number of friends who do a lot for them. These people could be more like parental figures than friends. And they could arrange things for them, make decisions for them, lend them money, do all kinds of things for them. So they will go above and beyond what normal friends will do. And this can mean that they often feel helpless and hopeless and depressed. And although they will want their friends to do so much for them, they could often feel controlled by them. But although they will feel controlled, it doesn't mean that they will be able to stand their ground or to cut their ties with someone who is extremely controlling. Because they will need them to do so much for them. And at this point it could be said that they just need to stand on their own two feet, to do things for themselves, to make their own decisions and to stop relying on other people to do so much for them. Because, of course, deep down they are an interdependent human being, not dependent human being, so they should be able to do more for themselves. And as they are an adult, it could be said that no one is going to save them. No one is going, going to come and take care of business for them. And if they do, just like with their friends, there's always going to be some kind of loss, some kind of compromise as well. But although it could be said that they just need to grow up, and to stand on their own two feet, there is a chance they are simply unable to do this. And what this could show is that during their early years they were often traumatised and this could have been something that took place during their developmental years. And so through not receiving the love, care and attunement that they needed and often being neglected, they would have often felt helpless. Because they were helpless. And this would have stopped them from receiving what they needed in order to grow and develop. And so although their physical body will have grown. And their intellect. Their emotional self and body will not have grown. And this is why they will need someone to come and rescue them. And this is because they will still feel like the infant, the toddler or the child that they were. And so they won't have the strength and the support within them, they won't be able to access these parts. And so in order for them to stand on their own two feet, in order for them to emotionally grow up, and to feel supported, and to have the inner strength that they need, they will most likely need to work through these emotional wounds, because once they feel like an adult, then they won't need to be rescued, they won't be looking for that either consciously or unconsciously, because they will be able to stand on their own two feet. So if you can relate to this, you can see that you often have the need to be rescued. And you have had enough of this. You have had enough of feeling controlled or being controlled. Then you may need to reach out for external support. And this can be from a therapist or a healer so that you can gradually change your life. Because the support that you are looking for is within you. So please don't suffer in silence. If you would like to find out more about the services that I offer, please go to www.oliverjrcooper.co.uk or email me at info at oliverjrcooper.co.uk and I'm looking forward to assisting you on your journey.